Alright, I'm making this video to show you a couple of updates and something that is still broken in the next gen edition of The Witcher 3. Starting with a piece of new dialogue, which was first brought to my attention by a member of my Discord called The Bloody Ermin, and it's an optional dialogue choice when you first encounter Dijkstra in the bathhouse, immediately after the fight breaks out. I actually booted up my backed up older version of the game to make sure that it's not there, just as I tested the new Yennefer romance scene I just posted in my last video. So I tried the exact same save on old gen and new gen, and there is indeed a new option that wasn't there before. Why do I doubt it? Let's give him a chance to explain. How are you, Reuven? Disappeared for a few years there, only to reappear here in Novigrad? Oh, I've been here, there. Spent some time in Zeracania, matter of fact. Hmm. What did you do in the desert? Sought oneness with nature. Magical place, really. But I missed civilization, so I'm back. Aimed to plant roots in Novigrad, become a respected citizen. And who knows, someday, maybe even a town councillor. I spent some time trying to figure out whether this is brand new or simply restored dialogue that just wasn't triggering or wasn't implemented for some reason, and I think I'm leaning towards the restored hypothesis. Because it doesn't sound as significantly different as Geralt does in the new quest. <sighs> Sorry, no comparison. Not about to sympathize. And Dijkstra sounds basically the exact same so perhaps it was recorded in the days of the original game. Whatever the reason might be, I can tell you for sure that it's not part of the original game. Now, the next thing I want to test is actually two things in Skellige, right before you enter Ker Trolda. First is the infamous blacksmith. He would normally refuse to talk to you unless you meditate, which did not always work for me, or unless you save and load the game next to him, which usually worked. Well, now he works right off the bat every time. Interested in the weapon? There's a tale behind every item I've got. And by the way, he has several stories to tell if you ask him the same question multiple times. This sword's hilt is made of meteorite steel. No, it's made from the heart of a fallen star. And the other thing was Yennefer's reaction to Geralt's beard. In the original game, she always had the one reaction regardless of whether you shaved or have full beard, that is because there was a bug preventing her from reacting properly, and there was indeed a mod which fixed it, and I'm happy to report that it is indeed working as intended now. Geralt, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Hmm? Your beard. Why did you decide to grow it out? Don't really know. Hmm, must say it suits you. Hmm, all those years. I actually wondered what you'd look like. And? Disappointed? You've not changed at all. Expect me to? What, could have dyed my hair black? The Black Wolf, how's that sound? People change. Men go bald, or grow beards. Willing to let mine fill in, if you enjoy being scratched. So good job on the developer's part. However, the final thing, which is sadly still broken in the next gen edition, is in Blood and Wine. When you're looking for the Beast of Beauclair in the Royal Gardens, you know, with the golden fish and unicorn and all that, there is a small interaction you can have with these people, where you feed the Duchess's peacocks. In olden times, folk would augur from the manner in which peacocks pecked at grain. Don't you mean hens? The common folk used hens, perhaps. Nobles augured from peacocks. In any case, for those who wish to see their fortune, there's more grain on the table. Well, actually, you can't have it because it's broken. You can't loot the cup. And once again, there used to be a mod that fixed it. They seem to like his seats. I wonder what a soothsayer would say to that. But it is still not properly fixed in the next gen, and I couldn't do it. So if any devs are watching, and assuming they're still updating the game, please consider adding that. Okay, I was about to upload the video, but I stumbled upon something else, and I thought I should include it. You know the higher vampires in Novigrad? Is it 1358 yet? No. Then fuck off! They used to transform into regular catacans, and I have a whole video about higher vampires and how they look and why they look that way, but suffice it to say, their models have been updated slightly. They still don't have the proper higher vampire form, 
but they do transform into a pimped up katakan essentially, as opposed to a regular one. With that, I believe I'm done. Let me know if you've stumbled upon any other such things, and until the next video, stay tuned and be good. Brave Sir Robin died after a tragic bowel unplugging. <laughs> <laughs>